fit in the world around me mm. I still can't feel at peace mm. living in this world around me there's always something Hey, Crystal. Hi. What's up? Hey, want to come over? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Wear something nice. Um, okay. that we just did, Joel. Anyway, guys, welcome. This is the very, very, very first concert takeover featuring the one and only Crystal Lewis. Can we get a shot of this pretty lady over here on the stage? 
Le yes, that's our girl. Thanks. Okay, back to me, Joel. <laughs> Thanks. Um, okay, so I'm your host, Jeremy Ryan, and joining me tonight is our very, very special super fan co-host. Adrian Casas. Yes, okay, so obviously you won the competition. For those that don't know, we ran a competition for someone to be my special guest host tonight. And you won and flew all the way here from where? Houston, Texas. Yes, okay, so what makes you such a super fan? I've loved Crystal since 1996. Uh, my pastor's daughter sang My Redeemer Lives in yeah. Spanish, and I fell in love with the song. And uh, she lent me her Beautiful Ashes album. And ever since then, it was like love at first listen. Of I course, because it's Crystal. Duh. Do you have anything to say to any of your friends yeah. that are out there? Back in 2001, I think we had a Crystal Lewis chat room or boardroom. Mm -hmm. So I met a lot of good friends there, and they all love Crystal Lewis. So I wanted to see if I can send a shout out to them. Absolutely. From Mexico, Israel, Naum, Agustin, Omar. From Argentina, Jonathan. Rachel from Puerto Rico. Eddie from Brazil. Joel from Peru. And from the States, Julian. Ada, DJ, Andy, Chris, Crystal Brown, Remy, Emily, Yay. Isai, Pablo, uh, Diana, and Jill, which uh, loves Crystal. She's not, uh, she loves Crystal because of Roundhouse. She's been following her since she was in Roundhouse. Wow. Well, we are so happy to have you here. Thank you for making the huge track down to here. Nashville. I'm <laughs> so happy. Okay, so together, yes. it's you and I, man. <laughs> Together with the fans, we are going to determine Crystal's set list tonight. You guys ready? Okay, here's how it works. You're probably so sick of me saying this because I've done so many videos today and posted so much. Um, I gotta read my notes or I will forget. Okay, we're taking song requests. To make a song request, you gotta tip at least $5 via Venmo, and our username is Concert Takeover. Easy. Or you can use PayPal, and that is concerttakeover at gmail.com. We do ask that you send those as friends and family on PayPal so they don't take out of a fee. We want our girl Crystal to get all that money, right? That's why we're here. Um, we literally have a team of people over here on the side that are tracking everything that comes in. Uh, so the more money that you tip for a song, the greater the chance you're going to get to hear it. And Guys, uh, already there's so many tips coming in. It's ridiculous, and I'm, I'm so excited. So we, re we really don't know how tonight's going to go because this is our first one, and it's just going to be a fun, happy, spur-of-the-moment mess, and that's my favorite. I love that. I love, like, literally before we started, they had to update your first song three different times because it keeps changing. So the more you tip... That song goes up to the top of the list. Guys, there's a twist. I promise I'm going to let her sing. There's a twist. Um, you want to tell them about our one twist, our yeah. big tip? The mega tip? Yeah, the mega tip. Okay, so <laughs> you guys can tip $100, and that will get your song moved all the way to the top of the list. Guys, we already have four. We have four mega tips. So when that happens... Okay, cover your ears. It's hurt, this hurt my ears earlier. Oh, that was, that was wimpy. There we go, okay. That's our mega tip. So we already have four, so it's not gonna be as fun. So if we get a fifth, then I'll do it then. And we do ask that, we love these mega tips so much, but we would like to limit it to maybe like five, just because there's so many fans out there making requests for these songs, and we want to make sure that we cover as much as we can. So we love the mega tips. Let's just do five. How's that sound, guys? Perfect. Cool. Okay. So there's another special twist, and Crystal, can you cover your ears? Can you hear me, Crystal? Can you hear me, Crystal? Okay. 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 So uh, here's the twist. You want to tell them the twist? Yeah. Somebody... Very, very special is going to be here. Special surprise guest that's going to maybe sing with Crystal. <gasps> maybe sing with Crystal. Maybe. So we're talking about a duet. Yes. A surprise guest. But. Do we tell him who that? Do nah, we tell him? Let's make them wait. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. He says we're going to make you guys wait. So at some point in the show, we're going to bring up a very special guest to sing with her. All right, Crystal, you can. Un 
Block your ears. You can uncover. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> All right. Okay. Guys, are we really ready actually, to do? Actually. Actually. Oh. Uh-oh. Actually. Uh-oh. I would like to um, add my own twist. Uh, we didn't talk about this. Well. Uh, I would like it to is add your a show. <laughs> <laughs> I would like to add a wrinkle. Woohoo! And um, and say that I have <laughs> I have my own little sound effect Where did over you get here. That? <laughs> and I'm gonna use it. I have created for myself. First of all, let me just say that doing something like this is very difficult for me because I like to be in complete control of my own set list. <laughs> um, not only just to choose the songs that I'm going to sing, but the order that they're in. Like, there's a reason that artists create specific orders on records and recordings and in shows because certain songs flow together nicely, etc. And tonight I have zero control over that. And so this is a stretch for me. So. I thought in an, in an attempt to gain just like the slightest bit of control, I made for myself three wild cards. Ooh. One, two, and three. Three. Three wild cards. And I will be using them throughout the night in varying uh, capacities. You're not going to tell us when? Uh, no, I'm not. Okay, fine. I'm not going to tell you. Okay. That's what the bell's for. Well, we have surprises, too. So. All right, fine. <laughs> um, I do have one note for you guys. Oh. And I want you to open it at the very end of the show. Okay. So after I sing the last song, okay. open it immediately. Okay. Like immediately. Okay. And say what's on here. Okay. Okay? That's what you're going to do. Okay. Wow. Well... Tonight, you are going to be giving up a lot of control because we are taking over your entire concert, and the fans have already spoken. We have a mega tip already. There's, I just want to tell everyone, we do have several mega tips right now, so I'm going to kind of like... It kind of depends gonna, on how long I can I'll, sing. I know, like, it's true. Well, I don't know what songs I'm doing. They might all be way too high for me now at this point in my life. I am going to try to spread some of the mega tips out so our other fans that are tipping in requests get their songs heard as well. Okay, are you ready for your first song you're singing for us? I'm ready. Okay. You are singing Over the Rainbow. <gasps> ah, that's going to be my response for every song, I think. <laughs> I love this one. Okay. Take I'll it away, it. girl. It's your show now. Oh, this is from Wild Beyonder. Maybe a little more um, vocal for me in the monitor, por favor. Oh, boy. <laughs> Somewhere
A way to start a show. Yes. Can I say something real Please. quick? Please. Um, so I want to say that, so that song, I, I assume people are familiar, I recorded when I was 16, 17 years old on the Wild Blue Yonder album. So a special hello to Chris and Joey and Paul. And um, I, those of you who don't know that, here's how you can find out information that you never knew you needed to know. Um, and that is by going to Adrian, Adrian Casas. Am I saying that correctly? You're is it Casas through. or Casas? Casas. Casas, okay. <laughs> um, he has created over the last couple of weeks the most exhaustive discography for me. I did not ask him to do this, but on his Instagram account, on Facebook as well, or not yes. just on Facebook as well, um, he has posted every single one of my albums and told information about them that I, I've never even had access to before. It's incredible, and I'm so grateful. So thank you, Adrian, so, so much for being here, for being a part of my journey and my story, and I love that I've been a part of yours all these years, and I'm just so grateful um, that you are here. I wanted to make sure I said that before we go any further. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> all, right. all right. That was amazing, Crystal, yes. and thank you. All right. We have our next song. So it's not a mega tip song, but it's one of the most popular songs of the night. Yeah. Are you ready? I'm ready. Dancing Through Tunnels. Shut up! Yes! No, seriously, it's your next fan favorite. Ah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm going to have to take my shoes off for this one. Do it. Oh, not this one. I'm holding my breath. Hope to reach the surface. Before it's too late hmm. I don't know which way Is up or down I'm all turned around Torn <laughs> between Staying hidden <laughs> Or finally found I wanna be found I wanna be found I wanna be strong I wanna try Beauty and love. I wanna be strong. I wanna die from the infinite center. I wanna be that woman <laughs> dancing in tunnels. The one who spends her fortune making friends. Above everything but all out of our control We can only find true peace of mind As it all falls I want to be strong I want to try from the infinite center Of beauty and love I want to be strong I want to try
Suck so much. Do you want my bell? No. Well, actually, I'm glad it doesn't work that great because this thing is loud. You guys get the point. Oh! oh. There we go. So you guys know what that means, right? Yes. Mega tip. Woo. So somebody. Do I get to know the names of these people, or do they? Some not have their asked. Name? Some have asked to be anonymous. anonymous. Okay. Um, Sunrise has the person who <gasps> is anonymous, <gasps> so we can't tell you. You guys. But also, this not. Is, is not just a mega tip. This is the next fan favorite in line as well. So everyone's wanting to hear this next song. We haven't even told her, have we? No. What did okay. you just say? Yeah, he's going to say it. Oh. Well, that was it. Oh. Sunrise. Sun I can't. <laughs> Sunrise. I just, I'm so excited. <laughs> I know. Sunrise. <laughs> okay, do I get to say a little something about each song? I'm going to stop Co asking. Honey, no, it is your concert still. Okay. You're allowed to do whatever you want. Thanks, Jer. <laughs> um, I wrote this song with my kid, with Solomon, my son. And we wrote it a couple of years ago, and it's on um, my most recent release, Rhapsody, which came out last year. And it's just one of my favorite songs. We wrote it as my, my little grandson slept in the other room. So special place in my heart for this one. Oh, yes. And we filmed such a fun video for this oh last year gosh. on roller skates. Oh, oh, my goodness. Filmed by Jeremy Wright. It'll be all right, it'll be all right. Rain or shine, breathe and dance. It'll be all right, it'll be all right. Sunrise means another chance. It'll be all right, it'll be all right. Rain or shine, breathe and dance. It'll be all right. Sunshine, I like it, though I don't mind the rain, the gray's okay, okay, I'll take it, each day brings a new way to make it, whether you encounter clouds or sunlight, it will be. It's so dark though, I know 
Literally just did that full voice. You like went for it. It's a show. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, by the way. Uh oh. <laughs> you get the gist, right? <laughs> it's like leaking all over my hand. <laughs> it's all right. We have another mega tip. Mega tip. All right. So this song has been recorded a lot of times by different people, but I think your version is like the best one. Even better than Celine Dion's. This is um, Oh Holy Night. Y'all, we're going full Christmas. Full Christmas. You ready for this? You got this. You got this. Do you need a minute? We can give you a minute. Oh, I'm good. She's a pro. Let's crank that. There's a tree in the other room. Do you want to bring it in? <laughs> My dear Savior's birth. Long lay the world in sin and never pining till he appeared and the soul felt its birth.
chains shall he break for the slave is a brother and in his name all oppression shall cease sweet hymns of joy in grateful First of all, how dare you? How Woo! dare you? Amazing. Uh, Feliz Navidad. Adrian, that literally just happened in oh, front of us. Like six feet from us. What? There. Are you kidding me? Crystal, you're how? like bringing it all out tonight. Okay, I will say that we are getting a ton of requests in. Your fans love you so much. And they're not just sending their requests. They're literally sending how much they love you and what you mean to them instead of just sending a request. That's, I just wanted to share that with you now. Like They are watching, and they are wanting to hear more from you. Okay. Yeah. So before we continue, shout out to Jill, mega tip for that song. Oh, yeah, that was Jill's mega yeah. tip. And a shout out to my family because uh, we did this song at church. Back in the day? Yeah. Like sign language kind of thing. Uh -huh. you know, remember back in the day in the church? Oh, yeah. So shout out to my mom and my sisters, Isabel and Fatima, and my friends, Alicia, Adriana, Carla, Joey, Eric, Roger, Samantha. Cause, uh, that's all your family? No, that's my friends and oh. family. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. But yeah, I have more family than that. <laughs> and uh, I also wanted to read something to you. One of your fans, with all the posts that I did, he wrote something. And every time he would uh, post about one of your albums, it was like he deserved the Grammy for his his uh, uh, review. So he says about uh, Beauty for Ashes, too much to talk about regarding this album. This was Crystal's bodyguard moment, I like to say. She could have stopped making music at this point and she will still be legendary. The Christian music industry was chock full of talented gospel artists like Yolanda Adams and Clark Sisters, etc., And CCM singers like Amy Grant and Sandy Patty. But then enter Crystal Lewis, we officially had our own Whitney, Barbara, Celine, etc. A big, unique voice that sounded great in multiple genres. 
I would love to hear her sing songs from this album that I haven't heard live, like Over Me or Healing Oil. So sweet. So, yeah. Thank you. I've always said that you're like our Madonna, (laughs) our Gaga, (laughs) our Cher. So, thank you. Also, Madonna just recently dyed her hair pink. I don't know if anybody knows. Copycat. (laughs) <laughs> totally she's copied copying you. crystal completely <laughs> copied you yeah we're freaking out over here just like yeah. the fans online like we yeah. are th- the biggest super fans oh i thought God. i met my match and actually <laughs> i really did meet my match no <laughs> i mean that song is so hard a uh, holy night and the way she performed it right now like like it was nothing Amazing. all right our next song giving you a little bit of a rest now we're ready you're ready for another one girl this is one of my all-time favorites. I never heard you sing it live, so I'm excited oh. about it. This is a fan favorite. Kay. Fan favorite from Gold. Kay. This is for such a time as this. Oh! I love this one, too. All right, let's hear it. Oh, wow. <laughs> I built my house here alongside this mountain. It's a rugged mountain, it stands so tall. I've had a good life above the lowlands, it's more than I'd asked for. Than I dream. I've often heard a voice call down to me. If you'd climb higher, you'd find wondrous things to see. But the way is steep, and the storm may come. For oh, such a time. Content to not ask those questions that stir the rivers that move the waves, the windless waters are so much more peaceful. The cold, my spirit, the silence.
Uh, I've been reading. Oh. Uh-oh. What you've been reading? What? Sorry. I, didn't <laughs> I was gonna say I have been reading some of the comments on the YouTube thread. Oh. I cannot wait for you to read them when okay. you're done. It's Thanks. just gonna make you so happy. Okay. Good. What's going on over here? <laughs> I'm waiting for my camera. Okay. <laughs> <Ooh>. Diva. <laughs> we have card number one. We're gonna. I made these special for tonight, so I'm using them, okay? Um, number one. Yeah. What I'm gonna do something a little special, okay? Okay. All right. It's your show. I mean, it's kind of our show, but it's kind of your show too. We'll so. share. I have this bowl. It has names in it. Um, the names in it are of people who submitted videos to um to come here and co-host the show. And Adrian, of course, was chosen. Here he is. And um but I wanted to pick a name of one of them and, and do a song. So we asked them randomly. They didn't know what this was for, um, what some favorites would be of theirs. So there's no cheating because everyone's watching. <laughs> Not that I would cheat. <laughs> okay, here we go. I hope it's a good one. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I love your reactions. Okay. The, I mean, literally, you guys, I don't know what's happening until this moment for all of these things. Okay. Nathan Russell. Uh, and he, I'm going to do Wisdom of Tenderness, which Just is one of my favorite him. songs. Oh, my God. Off of Holy, Holy, Holy. It's the one original song that wasn't an actual hymn, but it was written. I wrote it in conjunction with um, a Brennan Manning book. Uh, same title, Wisdom of Tenderness, and I read the book like three and a half times and um, it was just one of my favorites. So um, hopefully we can find the words to this one because, oh yeah, there they are. Wow, that's really tiny font. We have... S- Wisdom of Tenderness. We have such <clears throat> a huge team here. We literally have someone on I know, lyrics. and it's and we We have it. someone on Venmo and PayPal. We have someone on video, someone on audio, which I will say their names later. They're, they've just been so incredible for us. But we have a huge team here just to make this happen, just for Crystal to stand alone up there to sing her heart out. And we have the whole f- room of people. Most are in masks, unfortunately, but... Okay, how are we looking on lyrics over there? We got them? We're good to go? All right, Crystal, you ready to do this? I am. All right. Fun. Oh, I hope I remember it. I'm free cause Jesus loves me in spite of my Accepting that 
That was my touring band at the time when Holy when Holy Holy came out, and that was Sean Tubbs on guitar, um, who lives here in Nashville, actually. Sean Tubbs, um, Frank Lenz, just <laughs> killing it on the drums. Eli Thompson on the bass. Um, let's see who, oh, Gyro Chan on keys. I think Josh Thompson played on that, and Dickie Ochoa. So um, just, wow, wow. That brings back so many memories. Oh, my goodness. We are literally freaking out over here, just so you know. <laughs> like, I've heard you sing a gazillion times now, live, in person, and every time it still feels like the first time. <laughs> uh, okay, get a quick drink of water, because we have so many requests coming in, and I want to get as many as we can. Are you ready for your next one? Yeah. Oh, it worked that time. <laughs> oh, that really worked that time. <laughs> I can't hear out of my right ear now. Okay, your next song is Fe de Bochev from your new album. It is a mega tip. Um, that was anonymous, right? Yeah, so we can't tell oh you who it was. Oh, man. I don't know if these lyrics are online. I'll try and remember them. Yeah, we were, we were looking for them. I'll probably remember them, because okay. I love this one. Fe de Bochev. Uh, yeah. No. No. <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> I'll, I'll probably remember. We manage. tried to find it's them. It's French. Brian. <laughs> I bet you, I mean, I haven't put them online, so yeah. if someone else has put them up, thank you in advance. Otherwise, I'll try and do that later. That's the fun part of this time. show. You just go with it. Hey, I, I'm going to remember them. Yeah. Let's just go with you I'm going to remember Let's them. Let's do it. Oh, I love this song. I Wait, okay, the beginning of the track that you're going to hear in a second is... Um, a recording that I took, it's actually a, v no, I think it was a voice memo, not a video, of a man playing the accordion on a subway in Paris uh, when I was there a couple of years ago. So it's just a fun fact. Okay, go. <laughs> yeah. 
we are doing it. Again, featuring Sean Tubbs on the guitar, ladies and gents. Dance in my head, visions of you. Oh, I already forgot. And me. Visions of you and me. There we are by the sand in the rain after ten, walking and talking for hours. We wind our way through the streets, and I pray that you'll stay till the sun lights the flowers. Orange, pink, and red, roses in the sky, a green. All in a time, at least in my mind, all is as it should be. Not quite midnight yet, with a shared cigarette. That was pretty awesome for not having the lyrics up on the screen Thank for you. Thank you, whoever did that one, picked that one. I love that one. Yeah, okay. I want to get through this. We have so many coming in. Um, okay, first of all, we got a substantial tip from someone special from uh, Remington. <gasps> Remy! He <laughs> has a special request. Remington's he has asked that I ask Adrian, how are you feeling right now? Uh. I can't describe it. Oh, it's try like to. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like I'm not here, like so surreal. Like I've loved Crystal Lewis for 20 something years. You can get right up in that mic. Right here. There you go. And uh, I've seen her live many times, but to be here right next to her, it's crazy. listening to her sing like right here, I, know. I just like never thought it could happen. So thank you. Thank you so much for that. Nice. Oh, well okay, guys. Remember when I made Crystal cover her ears? When we first started? Scared. <laughs> you should be. No, you shouldn't be. Um, so, Crystal. Yeah. We have someone very special here tonight. Okay. That came to sing with you. Okay. So, everyone knows I actually gave Jeremy a list of people. And so, I don't know who on the list. 
Yeah, you know, I, and you don't know, know what you're singing either, do you? Do you know what you're singing? No, you don't. Because well, you, you don't even know? know who it is. Yeah. Okay, so you're ready for this duet you haven't rehearsed? <laughs> <laughs> yep. <laughs> Guys, I would love to welcome to the stage the founding member of Avalon, <gasps> the one and only Michael Passons is here. of times together on the gold tour you know I was speaking with Adrian right here yeah. do you know the night we did Houston the woodlands yeah, back in 1998 yeah he was grounded he couldn't go that night. what oh yeah. I'm so sorry I didn't know. well <laughs> you get a little yes this is an upgrade for you <laughs> <laughs> um Michael and I have we did the gold tour together we yeah. did a couple different Christmas things together. <gasps> I should have sent the picture. Uh, I have a photo on my phone. I just showed it, or I was just showing it to someone. Yes, we were in biblical Oh we my in biblical gosh! Costumes. Yes, but the reason I was showing it to someone is because we were talking about hoping to get together this week, and it's it's oh, your yeah. birthday right oh, now. Yeah, it is. Today's my birthday. Sorry, I'm screaming. So I'm sorry <laughs> there. about that. But that's yeah. It's Michael's birthday, you guys. And I'm choosing it to spend with you. Thank you. <laughs> Happy birthday. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> uh, also, we used to look a lot more alike. I felt like we were, once I cut my hair short, I feel like we've always kind of had this brother-sister thing going on, and now it's pink, I, so I, I, I might sorry. go pink, so I might <gasps> be inspired. Oh, my gosh. Do it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we want to hear you sing. Okay, beautiful okay. lashes. Sorry. Yeah, all we're right. just. Enough banter. We haven't seen each other all year. <laughs> Jeez. Uh, uh, oh, wait. Hold on. Sorry. So sorry. Before you start. This, uh, the track that I know is on this list, because I put it on here, um, because I figured somebody would request it, uh, it's a newer track to this um, older song, and it was done by my dear friends, um, Michael Wolford and Jonathan, um, <laughs> I'm just going to call him Johnny K, Johnny K and uh, Thomas Drayton, and they made this for me without telling me. It was like a gift to me when we were working together. They're this production team behind Dancing Through Tunnels and Bloom. Um, so this is. I'm going to follow it's your new. lead. It's new. Okay. Okay. Right. It's similar. i 
Happy, happy birthday. Thank you. I love you so much. Thank you. Uh, Is that happening next? What? No, it's not. Oh. Sadly. <laughs> <laughs> I, could, I guess I could get on there and donate $100 to hear it. <laughs> um, that was amazing. Michael Passens, thank you for uh, showing up sorry. and singing with our girl, Crystal. Okay, just so you know, Crystal, we have, we have a lot coming in, and I know that, you know, we how long has it been? It's uh, been about an hour now, okay? And I know that you still have, you have two wild cards? Yeah. Okay, great. And then there's like a, a good handful of important ones that we should try to get to as well. Yeah, so I'm going to stop talking. Um, you want to? <coughs> yes. So the next song is from the Gold Selling Beauty for Ashes. Four number one hits, right? I don't remember. It was four number one hits <laughs> and a top five. Yeah. Adrian knows. So this was not played on the radio, mm -hmm. but it's still one of your most popular songs from that album. And oh, they so want to listen to Healing Oil. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, but before you do, yeah. it, uh, mm -hmm. one request came with a beautiful message, and I just want to read it really quick. Mary Ann Lanting said that oh, she, want, my she wanted healing oil for her triumph over breast cancer. Wow. Love it. That's Mary Ann's a dear friend. All right. Beautiful. Let's this hear is it, for girl. you, Mary Ann.
can feel your healing love running down my brow. I wouldn't change another lifetime for how I feel right now. Love you, girl. That was incredible. Yeah. Okay, y'all. <laughs> I know, it gets us every time, right? Want to do the honors? We yes. have a mega tip. Obviously. Lo voy a decir en español porque es una canción que pidieron en español. Un saludo para Rachel de Puerto Rico. I just hope it's one that I can... You got it. I, I think you got it. So if you didn't know, Crystal Lewis sings in Spanish. She doesn't speak Spanish. I have Spanish. Sung in Spanish. Yeah. <laughs> And she's great, like she really is. So this song is "Cuán Grande Es Él." Oh, good! How I know great that thou one, art. Kind of. um, I've talked to a lot of people about this song, mm. and everybody agrees. You have the best version of this Thank song. You. Thank you. So, un saludo para todos los fans en español. Qué bueno que nos están viendo. Y aquí está una canción en español de parte de Crystal Lewis, "Cuán Grande Es Él." Gracias, and please forgive me in advance for <laughs> my inevitable mistakes. <laughs> I might do one verse in English. <laughs> Señor, mi Dios, al contemplar los cielos, el firmamento en la estrella, 
Just happened. For heaven's sakes, a lot of these songs are quite a bit higher than I recall. Oh, wow. but look at you belting wow. them out like it's nothing. Y en español. Oh. Yes! Okay, so here's <laughs> the deal, Crystal. There's at least, I know we're, um, we're short on time. You've been singing your heart out, and I don't want to abuse your vocal cords. So there's at least three important songs 
from fans that I would like to do, and I know that you have a few um, wild, card. wild cards. Thank you. So uh, let's talk about this. Uh, let me know how you're feeling. What I can potentially get my three down to two if I have to. Let's just do them. Just do them. Go. Do them. Okay. okay. Guys, gold. That is our next fan favorite. Ooh. That is not a mega tip. That is. What? That's a fan favorite. Wow. They really? all voted for this next. Um, this song, as well as Healing Oil, were both written by my dear friend, Chris Lizotte. So, mm. Uncle Chris. <laughs> Vitamin C. All right. <laughs> you guys ready to That's roll gold? Hmm. <laughs> Woo! Come on, girl. I love this one. I really do. woman abandoned by your husband left afar and the woman and to her children for well, half the love that they've been given has left them all of a sudden Blessed are those who mourn They shall receive great comfort Still I found death seems to bring forth Life To raise her children, she doesn't know the first thing about how to make a living. And all the birthdays and ball games and Christmas mornings will never be. Oh. 
I cannot believe you are still cranking out these songs, girl. You ready to do some more? <laughs> Get a drink of water. <laughs> Take a little rest if you need to. Okay, I do have. Um, do I even really need to do this at you this just point? Start my ears. Yeah, just close your ears. <laughs> Guys, it's well, dead. Line. It's like. <laughs> uh, Oh, it's okay. I thought oh, that was okay. Um, uh, we have two mega tips left, okay? And then we have a few fan favorites, but um, we should definitely get to the mega tips. Uh, so that's what we're going to do next. And then we still have a few from you if you want. I'm still keeping that in mind over here because you surprised me. What, I'll tell you what. I'll give you this little hint. Okay. I would like to close the show with my... One of my wild cards. With one of yours. Mm -hmm. Okay. Did you want to use your other? I'm not sure yet because okay. it depends on what people. Um, oh, gotcha. Okay. Request. You know what you're doing? Like, why so am I asking we'll you? See. <laughs> okay. We're going to go to Christmas. You ready? Oh, definitely. Yes. Go tell it on the mountain. Mega <laughs> tip, y'all. Tell it. <laughs> wow, that's a mega tip. Okay, cool. <laughs> Love it. Mm. Woo. Doing good, girl. While shepherds kept their watching or silent flocks by light, behold the wrath of heavens that shone a holy light. The shepherds feared and trembled when low above the earth rang out the angel chorus that hailed our Savior's birth. Go tell it on the mountain. Over the hills and everywhere, go dead on the mountain. Jesus Christ is born. Hey. Christ is born. We do have another another mega tip. I would like to ask this beast be our twin. So please, thank you so much for your mega tips. Um, um, I really just want to make sure we let 
everyone else hear their songs as songs as well, but we are appreciative of those mega tips. We just have one more that we'll accept, so please no more. Um, that uh, you want to tell them? Yes, this one is my favorite from the new album Rhapsody. It's c it's called uh, Mine for a Minute. <laughs> I knew you were going to. I'm surprised you didn't do a cartwheel. <laughs> and uh, uh, <laughs> if you guys haven't heard this one, please go check it out. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful lyrics, be beautiful performance from Crystal, of course. And uh, you're going to love it. Thank you. This is mine for a minute. Thank you, thank you, thank you. dream to pie in the sky <laughs> maybe I ignore the obvious signs but you can't blame a girl for trying funny how life can turn when I die No pair, no reason to rhyme. Like a wrench in the wheel of a paradigm. Like snow in the middle of summertime. I don't understand. I admit it.
to mention that was Carla White who mega tipped Carla, for you to thank sing that. You, Carla. And then for Go Tell It on the Mountain, that was a mega tip by Carolyn. You're gonna hate me, uh, Goiner. I don't know how to oh, pronounce. Oh, that's my cousin. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Great. My Am I saying it right? I don't know if I'm saying Gerner, it. Goiner. Right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, I miss you. Yeah. So I do have more. Okay. But it's you know. It's not really your show, but it, you're, you're singing, so I actually have to rely on you somewhat. <laughs> I feel like we've taken over a lot. So if you want to keep going. Um, 8.43. It's 8.43. You are sounding great. I mean, I, here's how I feel. It, as long as you want to keep singing, sing. People can just stop watching if they want. But it, it's, it's your vocal cords, girl, so we'll do whatever you want. I'm just checking my text real quick. <laughs> <laughs> um, I have three fan favorites lined up for you, okay. just so you know. Why don't we, let's do those three, and then I'm going to... Um, You're really going to do all those three, and then... Oh, well, I, I'm hoping they're not, like, crazy hard. Um, oh, oh, shoot, that's hard. I just, that's a spoiler alert. I just saw that, those lyrics. You got to do it now. Okay, fine. Um, okay, so your next song <laughs> is... here. The Lion and the Lamb from Beauty for Ashes. Oh my goodness, okay. Oh my gosh, this is a, this is a hard one, you guys. I know. <sighs> but you're going to sing it for us. <laughs> I'm going to sing it for you, yes. Who is he who's the mightiest of them all? Creation trembles at his call. Who is he? The lowly sacrifice, who paid a victim's price, and then there is Jesus. Jesus, from the Father's own.
of nature. <laughs> I, you realize this about yourself, right? I mean, you at least have to admit that. That's insane. You have been singing, what, an hour and a half, and she just oh. belts out, Lion and the Lamb. Oh, my gosh. Okay, so we have another one for you. Uh, this is actually a fan favorite, but it's a favorite song of uh, one of my good friends that's a super fan as well, Jack Welsh. Oh, yeah. yeah, he wanted this song sung so badly, and Jack, you're getting your wish. Um, he's actually responsible. Uh, I came up with the concept for co Concert Takeover with Jack. We were talking, we were texting back and forth. Again, he's a big super fan, just like I am. And we're like, okay, what are some cool things that we could do for Crystal? You know, we, we love her old stuff and we love her new stuff and we wanna hear it and how can we make her some money? Uh, literally, this is how her fans feel about her. They're always trying to like, how can we make Crystal more money? You already know what it is, don't yeah, you? Yeah, I'm uh -huh, It's okay. Um, Jack Welsh, anyway, uh, I came up with this concept talking to him. And thank you, Jack, for our conversation because it led to all of this. Okay, here's the song. My friend! I love this song. This song makes me cry. I'll just <gasps> try and sing it. Okay. Without crying. I love my, I'm so grateful for my friends, for my... Um, who have just been such a huge part of my story and my life. And um, the song says something about like years going by and t I don't remember it. I'll, I guess I'll, I'll know it at the <laughs> end when I see it. But um, he's scrolling through for me. Anyways, it just is, okay. it's this, wow, there's a lot of lyrics in this song. <laughs> The years will pass and times will change, but one thing will always stay the same, we'll always be friends. And I just have, as, as I read that, I'm reminded that life shifts and friendships change and relationships evolve and sometimes, you know, <laughs> we cycle through them and sometimes we come back around to them and sometimes we don't. But I think the fact that um, when a friendship is important in your life, it always gets to hold that place in your story. No matter if you have a falling out or things move on or whatever, there's always something really important about moments in time um, with your friendships. So um, the song is for all of my incredibly um, beautiful, wonderful friends. My friend, there 
always be friends. Oh, I love you, my friend, for giving to me, for being my confidant, for letting me be me, for sharing your heart, for taking a stand. I want. I genuinely feel so bad for everyone not watching this. <laughs> it's <Same>. true. <laughs> okay, I just wanted to acknowledge we did get a mega tip for wisdom of tenderness, and I just wanted to acknowledge, yes, we saw it, and thank you so much. She actually sang that earlier in the set, correct? Am I right in that? Right. Yeah. So she did it. So when we're done, w w yeah, when we're done, uh, when we end the live stream, just go back and watch it. Okay. All right, let's. Can we do one more and then my time? Yes, I only it? have one more oh. because I think, okay, I mean, I have more, but this next one I think you're really going to want to do. Okay. So from Rhapsody again, oh a fun gosh. one. I told you. Maybe you should call me. <laughs> <laughs> we filmed the music video for Maybe You Should Call Me in this very room. And it's a fan favorite. It, it wow. wasn't a mega tip. You had enough people tip okay. for this song. Thanks. <laughs> Love it, okay, let's do it. <laughs> I 
everything I said. You should call me tonight. Going. I don't know. It's a, it is an, it's a little bit unusual. I am me, not actually. complaining at all. It's and keep going. Is. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, people can just stop watching if they want. Well, I feel right. bad if people are still tipping. They like, are. I do have to stop at some point because I you am do, getting. Right. <laughs> <laughs> but you, <laughs> you have been fulfilling some great requests that have come in, like the top ones. So we got through the really important ones with the most amount raised. So y- you're crushing it. So okay. now um, I, it's up to you now. Wow, I'm giving up control of the concert okay. now. Uh oh. Sure you want to do that? Uh, I'm afraid she'll be mad at me if I yeah, don't yeah, let her. Let's let her okay. Go. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna use both my cards right now. Okay. Right. <laughs> yes. And I'm gonna. Well, we'll use number two first since that's next. <laughs> um, I did a song. This I was wasn't sure what I was gonna do with my cards because I thought maybe I'd do some uh, rhapsody songs, but there's been so many tonight that makes me so happy. So yeah. I'm gonna take it back. And um, Bryce and J. Michael, so you can. Be, I'm just gonna tell everyone what it is so they can pull it up and get ready. Um, this is a song called "This Too Shall Pass." <gasps> oh my. Oh God! And I was not ready for that. <laughs> Sorry. I figured I'm we gonna. Bo- if I'm gonna. We both did yeah. the gasp. <laughs> <laughs> they did. It was a collective <laughs> oh double gasp God. over here <laughs> on the They're peanut gallery. Out over here. <laughs> <laughs> oh so God. this too shall pass is a song. Um, you know the person that wrote it, right? Yes. yes. Ty. Tyler. Wow. Um. Uh, I recorded this song as a duet with Yolanda Adams. Um. Adrian, what year was that? <laughs> I do not know. I'm sorry. I don't know either. <laughs> it was a long time ago. Probably like 98, 99, 2000, somewhere in there, I would guess. Maybe before. And it was for a project called The Sisters Project. And The Sisters Project was a bunch of women artists that um, all collectively got together. And it was all either duets or trios. We all sang together. And it was one of my favorite things that I've ever been a part of. And a dear friend of mine, Janice Chafee, was 
sort of the executive producer um, in charge of that whole thing, and she passed away a few years ago. And so, um, and Yolanda has remained um, a friend and someone that I have connected with um, often through either Kirk Franklin or other just like shows that we've both been on. So um, this was is one of my favorite songs that I've ever had the privilege of recording. So um, it's one of my favorites. So I thought I would one do of our it. Favorites. Oh, um, we're freaking out over okay. here. Don't worry about it. <laughs> I'm going to worry about it. We're, I'm even going li to Instagram live. You okay, live. this one may very well do me in, so I probably only have one more in me after this anyway. So, okay. number two. Oh, sorry. Turbulence surrounding you. Ooh. These trying times that are so hard to win away. This is for now. In the middle of love, what seems to be your darkest hour, hold fast your heart. And be assured This too shall pass Like every night that's come before it He'll never give you More than you can bear This too It's in his hands. <laughs> this too shall be. Mm. Father knows the tears you cry before they. It's in his hands. 
it's in his hands, it's in his hands, this tune shall <laughs> what? I'm sorry, I'm still Instagramming live. Okay, look, Yolanda so sings hi, and I've never sung her part before, so that was a stretch. Oh my God. Uh, that was unreal. I can die happy. Didn't I just ask you about that song? Okay. You, no, we were talking. We were like, what about Shine, Jesus, Shine? Or it this too shall pass. pass, and I'm like, no one's requested it. I don't. I ca we can't. We can't tell her to sing it. Wow. Well, thank and then you, she brings out her wild card. Oh. Another one. <laughs> wild card number three. This was a little sad accident with the, the pen, but <laughs> there it is. Let's pull it. Uh, okay, I would like to end tonight. A song that <laughs> I've never sung live before. Well, that's not true. I've only sung it live one time. And it was in 1992 on the set of Roundhouse. And uh -oh. um, oh. you have to understand, no, these songs, sadly, like very sadly, have not um, ever been released as you know, tracks that you can purchase or stream or download. And the episodes of Roundhouse, for some reason, are very hard to, to find. I will say, Adrian sent me, as a special gift this year, a double DVD set of all of the Roundhouse episodes. So for the first time, <laughs> I got to sit and watch all of the episodes. I've never, I've never done that. I've never owned them. So, so grateful. Thank you so much. Super so, fan. <laughs> yes. So, so this, uh, this song is special because, um, I mean, every song that I was privileged enough to sing on that show was so special to me, and each of them resonated so deeply outside of the, just the episode itself, you know, and, and the context of the episode. But um, this one has always been one of my favorites. And um, like I said, no tracks exist for these. Like, I can't, you can't just, like, find a karaoke track for this song. It doesn't exist. And so I called my dear friend, Keith Thompson, um, who was our vocal director on the show, and um, we have remained good friends. And he was not only the vocal director, but he was sort of like the consummate artist handler, <laughs> uncle, <laughs> um, and coach, vocal coach, life coach. Like, he just kind of was our, our mentor. He was our Tim Gunn. You know what I mean? <laughs> yes. Um, so Keith Thompson, I, I called him yesterday. Yesterday. It was yesterday. And I was like, hey, I have this thing I'm doing. Can you help me out? And by last night, he had sent me a piano track to this song. You have it. So wow. I'm the only person that has it <laughs> because I'm the only person that ever you. sang it. Right. Um, so I'm just, I'm so, I'm so pleased to get to kind of, to, to share this, I've, like I said, I haven't done it for a long time. <laughs> <laughs> so um, this song is called I Do Not Care, and it, it was originally from an episode that was about me and my dad. Oh, shoot. Oh, I almost made crying. it all the way through without crying. <laughs> uh, this, uh, this episode was about my character and her dad. And um, she was a teenager, and she was embarrassed to be hanging out with her dad because she had a crush on a boy. And... Um, and they got in this little fight, and she was real mean to him. And, and the song was kind of like her realization that she did not care what anybody thought about who she loved. And she loved her dad. So um, the song is dedicated to my dad. But it's also, who I hope is watching. I hope he figured out the technology and is watching tonight. But uh, it's also just for all of us. It's for all of us as we travel along this crazy point in time um, and 
on the search for freedom and honesty and confidence and vulnerability and love. Um, yeah, this is called I Do Not Care. Can you tell by the way I hold your hand? I do not care if people stop and stare. I doubt if they would understand love's so rare. That was always there. I do. Okay, read your note. Yeah. Wait, really quick though. He is watching. They just sent this to me. They wanted you to know. That He's is watching. <laughs> okay, you gotta read it together. Ready? I'm ready. Reprise the theme song on and roll the credits. <gasps> Whenever my life gets me so down, I, I know, know I, I can, can go, go down. down. To where the music and the fun never ends As long as the music keeps playing You know what I'm saying, I'm saying I, I know that I can find a friend Hey, down at the roundhouse Woo! Oh. Woo! <laughs> Yay, thank you guys so, so we much We did it, we did it, we did it, we did it How were you still singing? Okay, I want everyone up here Okay, I have so many people to thank Joel Wilson on video, amazing. J. Michael Moore on audio. Bobby Wolf on cams. I got Bryce over here on our lyrics. I've got Tyler and Lane taking care of all of our uh, requests coming in. Obviously, Adrian. Guys! I want to say thank you to Recess in LA for this dress, too. Thank you, guys. Bryce, get up here. Come on, y'all. We're going to dance this out. We did it. Come on. Thank you so much for tuning in and being a part of this and supporting Crystal and 
for supporting Concert Takeover. Good night, everyone. That's it. Thank you so much. We can cut the speed whenever you want to, Joel. We did the thing, right? Woo! All right. We're good. Good night, everybody. Thank you so much for tuning in. You can re-watch it anytime you want.